I'm on my lunch break, so I don't have long to stream. And I'm going to be eating while I stream, but you know what? We all want to check this out. I got a special request from Solar Wolf. He would like to see the new outfit versus the old outfit with a tier 2 uh, Green Goblin slash Red Goblin. Let's start out with uh, not only getting his uniform up to Mythic, so it's a fair comparison, but let's also figure out what the new rotation is for his new outfit. Hey, Solar Wolf. So I'm going to go ahead and Mythic his uniform so it's a fair comparison. It's some, so dumb how the tier 3 buff barely boosted him. They do that a lot, though, where they make it more about the uniform than the upgrade. They want you to buy the uniform. You know, if people just tiered 3 him, they wouldn't buy the uniform, right? So, I get it. I don't agree with it, and I hear what you're saying, but... Hmm, I need more. <coughs> Wait a minute. Here's an epic quest thing now for his bios. Are you serious? I could have sworn you used to be able to buy his bios. They changed that? Hmm. It doesn't even make any sense. Yeah, so I can't uh, get him up to Mythic today. Fantastic. We're not going to have a fair comparison. Um, what options do I have? So I have attack speed, energy, attack speed, and dodge. Interesting. double check. Maybe I was just missing it. <clears throat> Epic quest or support shop. <coughs> That's what I thought. Well, see, that kind of sucks if they took that away. There we go. And why do I need the critical damage? Do I really need the critical damage? I do need the critical damage. Well, now the critical damage is right there. Let's go with attack power. Oh, I actually landed on critical damage. So yeah, I guess I do need it. So... <coughs> <coughs> Looks like I used to have critical rate on him. That's interesting. So, we have his Artifact, we have his Rage, we have Overdrive, Type 2 Enhancement of Rank 5, and uh, yeah, I could actually probably put some more stuff on here to clear up some, some of his stats to do more damage, I think. Let's first see 
what sort of rotation we're going to like on the Red Goblin, and then we'll do a comparison of side by side on Tier 2. There's a buff there right away. <clears throat> One's a filler. Five pops right away. So I feel like we're going to stick with the same rotation, probably. Three, five, four. Definitely want to wait for the bombs to drop. That's interesting. So they think it should be two, five. Oh, that's interesting. How's it going, Bionic Maestro? <coughs> wow, so is that supposed to be fast? So slash through them, five, drop for a few seconds. All right, so this, so they think two, five, three, four, okay. I don't know if that's the best one or not, but we can try it. <clears throat> I haven't tried them both out yet. All right, so let's go with my original outfit with my original rotation, and then we will compare that uniform score-wise to the new one. So Alliance Battle. This is the team up I'm using. <coughs> I do have <coughs> Black Cat's uh, artifact. All right, let's go. <coughs> Oops, I already messed it up. <clears throat> I throw a 2, and I do a 5-4. Oh, so it's the same. 2-5. Instead of 2-5-4, it's 2-5-3-4 with the new one. Why Craven instead of Mystique? <clears throat> 
What makes Craven a better support? And besides, I want to do a comparison of uniform to uniform before I go switching around with the support teams. <clears throat> so I want to see what I'm currently doing, and then we can try to put Craven in to see if we can get it further. Actually, I'm going to wait for a second because he's about to jump center. Or he should be jumping center. What the hell? I thought it was 26 that he jumped center. There we go. Just trying to piss me off. about average for my account. I've never used three for my rotation. It's about average for what I do. So let's uh, <clears throat> redo it again with the new uniform and then we'll switch up Craven. Then we can talk about using other rotations. All right. Hey, Grimson. See you in a minute? Okay. Tag me, please. I'm not going to be doing GBR, Crimson Nick. I'm just streaming during my lunch really quick. Alright, so 2 slash through, 5, 3, 4. Definitely a lot easier to cancel.
I mean, it does more, but uh, it's not like a significant amount more. It's pretty close, actually. I probably don't have his rotation down properly, though. So you said you think Craven's a better support option? I mean, this is going to increase basic damage dealt to supervillains by 40. So what does he do? He does 35 instead of 40, so why is that better? Oh, because of the increased skill damage as well. So it's going to stack. But this is skill damage and that's damage dealt. Yeah, you're probably right. It's probably a better option for him. <clears throat> She's probably still the best lead for him, though. So let me try again, but re really quick before I go into that, I want to one more time look at his skills. I want to see what this rotation thing is. You said you don't like the rotation thing? I kind of like it. So he's supposed to slash through. It's hard to see what the visuals are when I'm looking down at the bottom here. Alright, so like the first one and the second one's like a second. Second. Oh. Oh wow. Fives them as instant cancel on this. There's like two seconds before the last one. Okay. I don't like it because most of the times these combos won't be accurate. Why? possible.
Oh crap, I don't have Craven. Alright, well we'll run again with, with Craven here in a second. I mean, that's not terrible. Or for the tier 4, they do the 7th skill first, though most of the time you do 7th in between the rotation. Well, I mean... I scored more than your tier 3 goblin. Let's try it with Craven. I think you're right, Craven's probably going to be better. I will get a tier 3 goblin. I just, I need the speed books first. Hard to keep his proc on. Unless I completely skip doing the one, which I don't really want to do. I want to do one as a filler because it helps me continuously attack and gives me enough time to have my four cooldown so I can get in, get it in the next combo. But I don't know. It might be better not to fill it with one. He's going to jump center. I'm just going to wait a second.
I mean, I, I don't really see a big difference between using Craven and Mystique. I really, I really don't think there's a huge advantage there, honestly. But, uh, I don't know. 9, 2, 1, 9, 2, 9, 4. 9, 2, 1, 9, 2, 9, 4. Yep. I mean, still Goblin's obviously going to be the best for the day. I've got an insight on uh, Black Cat, and I guess the new rotation is 2, delayed cancel, 5, cancel, 3, delayed cancel, 4. Um, and I guess, which ones can we cancel with? I know we can cancel with 2, 5, and 4. But is there other ones I could cancel with as well? I can't remember now. Let me try one more time without having the one in there since I kind of added the one at like last minute. Then I can also check and validate uh, which one of my skills can cancel. I got 10 more minutes on my lunch. I got to get back to work. All right. So, two, four, five, six. When I get six. Okay. time I'll move around so there's about three seconds left on my four. Yep, that's pretty good. Keep my procs on. Around to three seconds. Dash, five, three, four. Proc. That's about three seconds left. Two, five, three, four. Yeah, no, it's better if I use the one as a filler. It's about 200k less. So yeah, I, I'm not really even seeing a huge difference on the uniform, man. To be honest with you, Solar Wolf. But remember, I'm also using Black Cat's leadership, which is probably why I'm scoring more than your tier 3 Goblin, I assume. 
Um, but we're definitely going to have to get him tiered 3. And we're also going to need to finish working on the rest of his stats and attributes. Because, yeah, those aren't in a good spot either. All right, so what 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 can we what can we move around here? So definitely have plenty of critical rate and plenty of dodge. So let's change this to auto changed either all attack or energy attack because I assume I'm still an energy attacker. If not, I'm doing something wrong. Uh, let me let me double check. Yeah, still energy attacker. Okay, so that didn't change. So I don't need the dodge. What else can I put over here? Nothing really is going to help that much, so we'll just leave it alone. What about these attack speeds? Nothing major there. Nothing major there. Okay, so we can leave all of those stats alone. What about your, your gear? What is your last gear? It's on cooldown. Do I need that much cooldown? Um, 9%. I don't know if we need that much cooldown or not, but we do need some critical damage for sure. So we are going to equip some Uru that has critical damage with it. It's energy attack critical rate, which I don't really need. As physical attack critical damage, which I don't really need either for this character. Uh, so yeah, so no Uthen's Blessings for this guy, but let's look at critical damage. We'll go ahead and equip one of these and one of these over here and see if we can't get up to high enough critical damage to not needed on the stat, I think we're going to be able to pull this off because we got plenty of slots that are not being used. So let's go critical damage one more time, see what it does to our score, because I don't remember how many points it goes up per. Definitely need more. Alright, now how do we look? We actually could get more movement speed. I could change one of those dodges to a movement speed. I hate doing an air critical damage, but I'm not really sure what else to spend it on at this point. So I guess we will do some more critical damage. All oh, those aren't even maxed out, huh? M main reason to do this is just to up his character score as a whole. Alright, one more critical damage will do it for this guy. Alright, so now we got the critical damage stuff capped out. We've got some more attack on him because of the energy. We don't need that dodge, but we could use a little bit more movement speed, even though it's not going to make or break the character. So I am going to go ahead and go to the uniform, and I'm going to change one of these dodges to... Oh no, those are attack speeds. But I don't need the dodge. Can I move this to movement speed? I can. Let's move this one to movement speed. Wow. Dodge, 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 huh? That's that's absolutely insane right there. I can't believe how many times it hit the exact same thing. All right, that's getting a little bit ridiculous. Really? Wow. That was an expensive stat change. All right, now let's see what his info looks like here. So now we've got that maxed out. That's all maxed out. Cool, we're in good shape. I think that's pretty good. Um, I mean, I've got some more spots, but I'm really not sure what to do. I don't, is, is there a recovery rate one? I don't know if there is a recovery rate one. There probably is, but I just probably never use it. Yeah, there is a recovery rate one. So I guess technically I could do a recovery rate one. Um, just to fill these out with something. Feel like they're wasted slots when you don't use them. I just I don't know what else I really need to put in there, you know. Hmm. I guess I'll just slap a hit point one in the last one. I think that usually boosts your score pretty high, isn't it? At least it's not blank, right? Okay. 984. So let's try one more time, and let's see what it does. They don't know their game skills for mags doesn't even use 2 and 1. 
I wonder what rotation did they give to Magneto and skill combo thing. Well, what recommendation do you have for a rotation for Red Goblin then? Because I'm definitely willing to try something else, but I'm not really sure what else to try. Really? I, I don't know why I'll retarget. I wish you could just lock onto the freaking beast, man. These stupid minions take away so much damage that we could be doing otherwise. And the way the beast jumps around makes it such a pain in the butt to play this match. Even after all of that tweaking, adjusting, and adding extra Uru, I still scored less. All right, and that's the end of my lunch break, so thanks for hanging out with me for however many 40 minutes, and uh, we'll, we'll catch you on another one. But hopefully, Solar Wolf, that answers your questions, and at least you got to see it firsthand what's going on with stuff. So, yep, on that note, catch you later.